Welcome, today we're diving into a topic that your body may be screaming about, pancreatic issues. The pancreas, a crucial organ, often whispers its troubles before it shouts. It's important to know how to listen. We'll be exploring the many functions of the pancreas, identifying early signs of potential problems, and discussing foods that can benefit pancreatic health. From understanding pancreatic cancer to recognizing its symptoms, we'll cover it all. Stay tuned to learn more about this vital organ and the signs that may indicate a potential problem. So, what exactly is pancreatic cancer? It's a silent invader, often going unnoticed until it's in the advanced stages. Pancreatic cancer starts stealthily, originating within the cells of your pancreas, a vital organ lying behind your lower stomach. It's a key player in our body's digestive system, producing enzymes that help digestion and hormones that manage your blood sugar levels. When cancer cells take root here, they multiply uncontrollably, forming a tumor that can spread rapidly to nearby organs and blood vessels. And here's the catch. Pancreatic cancer is notorious for its sneakiness. It quietly progresses, often without any symptoms, until it has advanced significantly. This cunning nature makes it one of the most challenging cancers to detect and treat. So, you might be wondering why early detection is emphasized so much. Well, the answer lies in the statistics. When detected at an early stage, the five-year survival rate for pancreatic cancer jumps to about 24%, a significant increase from the mere 3% when diagnosed at a later stage. Early detection not only improves survival rates, but also expands treatment options. Surgery, which is currently the only potential cure for pancreatic cancer, becomes a viable option. That's why it's crucial to pay attention to the early signs your body may be giving you. Recognizing these signs could be your body's way of whispering that something is amiss, potentially leading to an early diagnosis and a better chance at beating this silent invader. Now let's explore some common symptoms of pancreatic cancer. These signs might be your body's way of alerting you to a potential issue. First up, abdominal or back pain. This is often one of the initial symptoms and can be quite vague. The pain may start as general discomfort in the stomach area that can radiate to the back. It's usually persistent and may become worse after eating or lying down. Next is jaundice, a condition that causes yellowing of the skin and eyes. This happens when a tumor in the pancreas obstructs the bile duct, causing bilirubin, a yellow pigment to build up in the body. Unexplained weight loss is another common symptom. This could be due to the cancer affecting the body's ability to digest food or due to a decrease in appetite, which is also a symptom. On the topic of digestion, many people with pancreatic cancer experience digestive problems. This could mean nausea, vomiting, or a bloated feeling after eating. These issues arise because the tumor may interfere with the pancreas's ability to help with digestion. Lastly, changes in stool can be a sign of pancreatic cancer. This can manifest as unusually smelly stool or stools that are pale or greasy. This happens because the pancreas isn't producing enough enzymes to break down fat, causing it to be excreted in the stool. These are just a handful of the common symptoms associated with pancreatic cancer. It's important to remember that these symptoms are quite general and could be related to other less serious health conditions. However, if you're experiencing one or more of these symptoms, especially if they're persistent or worsening, it's crucial to consult a healthcare professional. Remember, these symptoms can also be related to other health issues, but it's always better to be safe and discuss any concerns with your doctor. There are also less common symptoms that you should be aware of. Often when we think of pancreatic cancer, we associate it with the more common symptoms such as abdominal pain, jaundice or weight loss. However, there are additional less common signs that can serve as red flags indicating a potential issue with this vital organ. Let's start with blood clots. While these can occur due to various reasons, an unexplained blood clot in a large vein, often in the leg, could point to pancreatic cancer. The scientific term for this is deep vein thrombosis or DVT. This happens because cancer cells can release substances that cause the blood to clot. Next on our list is diabetes, particularly the sudden onset of type 2 diabetes in individuals who are not overweight. It's worth noting that diabetes doesn't automatically mean you have pancreatic cancer. However, pancreatic cancer can affect the production of insulin leading to diabetes. Therefore, an unexpected diagnosis of diabetes coupled with other symptoms might warrant further investigation into your pancreatic health. 
Along similar lines, individuals already diagnosed with diabetes may experience a sudden change in their ability to control their blood sugar levels. This is also linked to the pancreas's role in insulin production and a sudden change could suggest a problem with this organ. Finally, an unexplained sense of weakness or feeling very tired can also be a symptom. This is because pancreatic cancer can cause a decrease in appetite, leading to weight loss and malnutrition, both of which can result in fatigue. It's crucial to remember that these symptoms are not exclusive to pancreatic cancer. They could be related to other health conditions as well. However, if you consistently experience any of these symptoms or notice they're becoming more severe, it's worth discussing them with your healthcare provider. Again, these symptoms could indicate other health problems, but they could also be your body's way of signaling a problem with your pancreas. Understanding these symptoms and recognizing them early could be a game changer. It's not an overstatement to say that this could be a matter of life and death. Pancreatic cancer, like any other disease, is most effectively treated when caught in its early stages. The earlier it's detected, the wider the range of treatment options and the better the chances of survival. Just imagine a small flame easily extinguishable when it's just starting. But if left alone, it could grow into a wildfire, far more challenging to control. That's what happens in our bodies when early signs of disease are overlooked. The little flame of pancreatic cancer, when detected early, can be dealt with more effectively. It's common to dismiss symptoms as trivial annoyances, an upset stomach, a sudden weight loss or persistent fatigue. We often attribute these signs to stress or a busy lifestyle, but when these symptoms persist, they might be signaling a more serious issue like pancreatic cancer. Some people may feel hesitant or scared to consult a doctor. The fear of the unknown can be overwhelming. But remember, knowledge is power. Knowing what's happening in your body gives you the power to take action. It allows you to make informed decisions about your health. An early diagnosis can significantly improve the prognosis. It can open up treatment options such as surgery, which might not be feasible in later stages. It can also mean less aggressive treatments, reducing the impact on the patient's quality of life. Recognizing early signs isn't just about increasing survival rates. It's about empowering individuals to take control of their health. It's about giving them the chance to fight, to hope, and to live. So pay attention to your body. It's the only one you've got, and it's doing its best to communicate with you. Listen to it, understand it, respect it. Don't ignore your body's signals. Early detection can make all the difference. Remember, your health is in your hands. Every moment counts and every sign matters. Don't wait until it's too late. Seek help and keep the flame of hope burning. So there you have it, we've covered the common and less common signs of pancreatic issues. As we've journeyed together through this conversation, we've shed light on a topic that's often shrouded in misunderstanding and fear, uh, pancreatic cancer. We've explored what it is, why early detection is vital and the various symptoms that might signal its presence. We've discussed how abdominal or back pain, jaundice, unexplained weight loss, digestive problems and changes in stool are common symptoms of this disease. These are the body's ways of telling us that something is not quite right. We've also delved into the less common symptoms such as blood clots, diabetes and a sudden onset of fatigue. These symptoms might not scream pancreatic issues at first glance, but they could be indicative of a problem that is hiding in plain sight. But remember, these symptoms don't necessarily mean you have pancreatic cancer. They could be due to other health issues. However, if you're experiencing any of these signs, it's essential to seek medical advice. The key is not to panic, but to be proactive. Early detection can make a significant difference in the treatment and management of pancreatic cancer. It's about taking control of your health, being vigilant and understanding your body. It's about not ignoring the signs your body is giving you and seeking help when necessary. So if you're experiencing any of these symptoms, don't push them aside or explain them away. Listen to your body. It's wiser than you think. Seek medical advice. You're not overreacting. You're just being responsible. Knowledge is power and understanding these symptoms empowers you to make informed decisions about your health. So keep this information close, share it with your loved ones and let's spread the word about the importance of early detection. Remember your health is in your hands. Don't ignore the signs, stay healthy, stay informed and take action when necessary.